Now he drives up. Got on your feet, shoes, um, dirty things, shoes, sweaty feet. Oh, Chris, getting ready yep. for a bit of an adventure. So, where are we now? Right now, we're at Water Mouth Bay. Yeah, we're at Harbour actually. Max, and we've just met the Harbour Master. Whose name is Keith Alsford, and it says it on his door, which is just behind me there. So, I've never had a door named after me, have you? Chris Door. Loads of them. Christopher. Christopher, yes. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not an official <laughs> door. But, yeah, so we're here now. We're going to go to our start point, which is the castle, which is just up there. You can't see it, can you? Because we haven't got there yet. But we're going to be there two minutes. We had to kind of stop here, really. Um, I think we would have would have actually gone in, wouldn't we, Chris? But then it's not the most inviting. I'd go in there. I think we'll find better bays along the way, though. Yeah. So. adventure so yeah it's time has come this is the starting point watermouth castle let's do it let's go gone <laughs> goodbye socks oh, they are actually oh, that feeling when you take them off back to nature oh, no, it's just they can breathe and freedom <sighs> yeah high <laughs> feet my mum and dad gave me these. Yeah. <laughs> Taking the shoes off, we realised we actually still got to take the shoes with us as we paid money for them. So, I've now invented something called science, which is going to take the world by storm. Look at that. We have no idea what this thing is, do we, Chris? Chris thinks it's for a skiing pole. Uh, somebody's probably... <laughs> oh no, one more. Just been caught for not wearing shoes at Watermouth Castle. Wear some shoes! Ow! Show some shoes! Ah. <laughs> some socks! <laughs> <laughs> right, so hopefully I'll be set free soon. <laughs> but <laughs> barefoot and the first problem as you can see is where man builds a path grass perfect speed this out 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 well first barefoot injury sustained sir chris i need to sit down hold on but, oh he's got to sit down that's a shame isn't it look at the view And we're headed that way now. So, oh, here we are, trying to do some barefoot walking. Chris is a lot faster than me at this moment in time. So I'm stuck back here. Um, Slow and steady wins the race.
Time to get in the seat and go for a swim. Or, if you're Chris Ellis, time to put on a swim out and goggles and go for some kind of Olympic record. <laughs> Go on, go on, go on, go in! Dan, 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 Luke's about to get wet! Head under! Head under! Head under! Oh. Oh. I can't quite get you because they've got the bright on the, uh, the sun. There you go. Got a head under, Lou. I have done it. Have you? Again. Yeah. Again, again. Wait, wait, head under, wait. head under. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> 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 Christoph, officer, <laughs> ready for the. <laughs> Sorry. Uh. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we've walked barefoot all the way from Watermouth to Martin's Cone and we're just having a swim in the sea. You can probably just about see Chris in the distance, he's gone a bit rogue, I'm just having more of a casual swim, so join me for a dip. It's a bit hard to see Crystal. There he is. Here he is. The Wanderer, the Wanderer returns. Yes, Chris, how was it? It was beautiful. Was it? Just me in the ocean and there was a rock. I could just send to my feet. I was right out there. I just stood up like this. And this rock underneath me, it was amazing. It was like... Hello sunshine. Hello sun. <laughs> oh, I love stuff like that. Yes. Well, here we are at the top of what's it called, Chris? Coon Martin. No, uh, the sign. So. Hangman, I think it's called Little Hangman, um, which is above Coombe Martin, which you can probably just see below. Um, yeah. What a lovely evening. Great evening. to get the camera out there Chris. Yeah. Five star accommodation. Five star, yeah. Hilltop Hotel. And your accommodation... A night. How much a night? £120 plus fat. Do you get a sea view of that? You do. And breakfast. And breakfast? Breakfast in the Hilltop restaurant in the cafeteria lounge. No, that's too expensive. Ah! <gasps>